adding two digit numbers with carrying. Starry, look at this set of sticker pages I have found in my old bag. This sticker page is of stars. Let us see how many stars are there. 14 stars are still remaining. Hmm, Starry, I have an idea. Let's make a group of 10 stars and the remaining stars we shall use for decoration. How many groups of 10 stars will be formed, Starry? Yes, one group of 10 stars is formed and 4 stars are left. We can also write this as 14 stars equals to 10 stars plus 4 stars or 14 units is equal to 1, 10 and 4 units. The next sticker page is of smileys. Hey Starry, there are 17 smileys on this page. How many groups of 10 can you make? Yes, one group. How many smileys are left? That's right, seven. We can also write it as 17 units equals to 110 and 7 units. So Starry, when there are more than 10 objects of the same type, they can be converted to a group of 10s. For example, convert 19 units into tens and units. 19 units will be equal to 1 ten and 9 units. Did you understand? Ok, then fill in the blanks. 6 units plus 5 units is equal to dash units. 6 plus 5 is equal to 11 units. 11 units is equal to 1, 10 and dash. Yes, it is 1 unit. Look at the next one, Starry. 7 units plus 9 units is equal to dash units. Can you answer this, Starry? Yes. 7 plus 9 is equal to 16 units. 16 units is equal to 1 ten and 6 units. What about 13 units, Starry? Yes, it can be written as 1 ten and 3 units. Hey, Starry. Suppose instead of 14 units, there are 2 tens and 14 units. Then will you be able to split 14 units? Yes, 14 units will be split as 1 ten and 4 units. Then 1 ten gets added to 2 tens to form 3 tens. Thus we get 2 tens, 14 units is equal to 3 tens, 4 units. Similarly, Starry, what will 1 ten and 17 units be equal to? 17 units is split into 1 ten and 7 units. So 1 ten and 17 units is equal to 2 tens and 
seven units. Let us solve some examples now. Here is the first question. Two tens and fifteen units is equal to how many tens and how many units? Yes. Study. First, we will split fifteen units into one ten and five units. Then we shall add one ten to two tens. So we get the answer as three tens and five units. Two tens, seventeen units, is equal to dash tens and dash units. Can you fill in the blank, Starry? Yes, two tens, seventeen units, equals three tens, seven units. Starry, we have first learnt how to split units. Into tens and units. Using this information, now we shall learn addition by carrying over. Take a look at this example. Add seventeen plus nine. What should we do first, Starry? Yes. First, let us arrange the numbers properly in the tens. And units place. Write one in the tens place, and seven in the units place. Next, write nine below seven in the units place. Let us now add the digits in the units place. Seven units plus nine units equals sixteen units. Can we write? Sixteen in the units place of the answer. No, so we write sixteen units as one tens and six units. Write six in the units place of the answer. One ten is carried over to the tens column. Now we get one ten. Plus one ten is equal to two tens. Therefore, seventeen plus nine equals two tens, six units. That is twenty-six. Let us solve the next example. Add thirty-seven plus six. Can you solve this example, Starry? Yes. First, let us arrange the numbers in the proper columns as shown. Now, add the digits in the units place. What do we get? Yes, seven plus six is equal to thirteen units. What should we do next, Starry? Yes, we carry over one ten to the tens place. Now, adding digits in the tens place, we get three tens plus one ten. That is four tens. So, Starry, thirty-seven plus six is equal to forty-three. The next example is add forty-four plus six. Let us arrange the numbers first. Now, adding four units and six units, we get ten units. Hey, Starry, wait! We can directly write the carried over tens in the tens column. So we write one at the top of the tens column and zero in the units place of the answer. Now, adding tens place digits. We get four plus one, that is five tens. So, Starry, forty-four plus six equals fifty. 
In the next example, find the sum of 8 plus 77. Let's add the digits in the units place first. 8 units plus 7 units equals 15 units. Carry over 1 to the tens column and write 5 in the units place of the answer. Now, Starry, add the tens. Yes, 7 plus 1 gives 8 tens. So, what is our answer? 8 plus 77 equals 85. Do you know, Starry, when you will become well versed with carrying over, you can keep the carried over digit in your mind also. For example, add 69 plus 4. Can you add the units place digits? Yes, 9 units plus 4 units is equal to 13 units. Here the carried over tens is 1. Instead of writing it on the top of the tens column, keep it in your mind. Write 3 in the units column of the answer. Then adding 6 tens plus 1 ten, we get 7 tens. So study 69 plus 4 equals 73. Okay, Starry, here's the last example to add single digit number to a two digit number. Find the sum 89 plus 9. Do you want to solve this one, Starry? Okay, 9 units plus 9 units equals 18 units. Carry 110 to the tens column. Now adding tens, we get 8 tens plus 110 equals 9 tens. Thus, 89 plus 9 equals 98. Starry, look at this addition carefully. Here we are adding two two-digit numbers but the method remains the same. Add 57 plus 25. What is the first step, Starry? Yes, we first add the digits in the units place. 7 units plus 5 units equals 12 units. Now, let's carry over 110 to the tens column and write 2 in the units place of the answer. Adding tens, we get 5 tens plus 2 tens plus 110 equals 8 tens. So, 57 plus 25 equals 82. Which is the next example, Starry? Okay. Add 66 plus 29. Here, adding 6 units plus 9 units, we get 15 units. Let's carry 110 to the tens column. Now, adding tens, we get 6 tens plus 2 tens plus 1 ten equals 9 tens. So, 66 plus 29 equals 95. Starry, while adding two two-digit numbers, also we can keep the carried over tens digit in mind and then add. Let's see how. Add 15 plus 78. First, we arrange the numbers in proper columns. Tell me, Starry, how much is 5 units 
plus 8 units? Yes, it is 13 units. We write 3 in the units place of the answer and keep in mind the carried over 110. Now let's add 10 place digits. 110 plus 7 tens plus 110 equals 9 tens. So Starry, what's the answer? Yes, 15 plus 78 equals 93. In the next example, empty boxes are shown. Fill them appropriately. Add 59 plus 37. 9 units plus 7 units gives 16 units. Carry over 110 to the tens column. Write 6 in the units column of the answer. Next add 5 tens plus 3 tens plus 1 ten. We get 9 tens. So the answer is 96. So Starry, remember, addition can be done by any method, but adding the carried over tens is very important.